Today I'm going to be reviewing the Beto dishwasher DFN28R21W. Retails at £279 from AO. Okay, key information from this dishwasher. It's a 13 place setting dishwasher which is ideal for a medium sized family. It's got eight wash programs and it works from a push button LED control panel. Okay, so let's go through the control panel. So on the top, if we just look at the top, it's got all the program numbers and what, what temperatures they wash at. So we'll just show you how these work, okay? So you switch it on, okay? And then you scroll through by pressing this number, okay? So this gives you all the different settings and the times that they run for, okay? To find out which is the ideal setting for the stuff that you're washing, refer to the manual on page 26. It's got program type, um, what kind of dishes, whether they're heavy soiled, light soiled, glasses, etc. It tells you the, then it tells you, also tells you the temperature that it washes at, and it also tells you the um, length of time it washes for. Okay, so this is really good to refer to, so you've got used to how the so dishwasher runs. Functions here, we've got half load, which is self-explanatory. Fast Plus. Now, whichever program you choose, you press Fast Plus, and then that will reduce the time that that program takes. So it won't reduce the temperature it washes out; it will just reduce the overall time. Okay. Steam Gloss. This is a superior drying performance function, so that you, you, your dishes come out really dry on that one. Um, time delay. Now, this is very good for people who get say cheaper electricity at night for example press time delay and it goes within increments of 30 minutes so you choose your desired time and and then that will set to come on however time whatever time you decide it to to cancel any function you press this button here so you start you can pause and you can cancel you have to hold hold in for three seconds to cancel any program you decide to choose these two lights here is one is for salt and one is for inside and they tell you if they if you need to fill them up or not. Now this button here, Aqua Intense, will lead me to the inside of the dishwasher. So if you press this button, let's just have a look inside. There's an impeller just here, which is very good for very soiled items that need washing. So we've got a lower lower basket here which comes out where there is also a cutlery tray which is great it can be moved about slide up and down so these here also can be lowered down so it all depends on what kind of stuff you're putting in the dishwasher as to how you use this part then we've got a upper basket which comes out and again these can be moved lowered down you've also got this here to protect glasses okay and then above that is an upper cutlery level which is great for putting spoons bigger items of cutlery that would be too high to put in the lower one okay so that's all your baskets and inside here um, this is a salt dispenser this is the paddle I was talking about earlier so ideally you would put a heavily soiled item here and that would um, wash wash it quite intensely really and then here this is where your rinse aid goes and this is where your detergent goes either tablet or liquid form whichever you want to use so there you go that's the inside of the dishwasher so we'll load it up now and then we'll have a look at it working okay, okay. so i've loaded the dishwasher as you can see um it's quite a lot of quite soiled items in there. I've used all three sections. I'm going to use a dishwasher tablet which I'll pop into there. Let's close it up. Okay so switch it on. I'm going to use program three so that's going to be on for three hours 
nine minutes. Okay, so let's start it. Okay, so that's quite noisy to start, but then I can assure you it does go very, very quiet. So it's a very quiet. So as you can see now, we're two minutes in and just take a second to listen to how quiet this appliance actually is. So very quiet. We'll come back to the dishwasher when it's finished its cycle and we'll look at the finished results. Right, okay. so it's finished its program. As you can see, all the lights have now gone out, indicating it's finished. So let's have a quick look inside how clean it is. Let's just take the dish out. Okay, as you can see, very clean plate. So overall, it's done a good job. So let's talk about the pros and the cons of this dishwasher. Cons, sorry, the pros, very good value for money compared to other dishwashers out on the market, £279, which I think is a pretty good price for um, a dishwasher, and it is very quiet when it's on. Negatives then, okay? Um, to be fair, this cutlery drawer here is a bit of a pain because it does limit you to what, as you can see, it's a bit tight, it does limit you to what you can put in this drawer and some of the stuff's a bit wet so you'll need to dry that but overall yeah definitely would buy this dishwasher and recommend it to people okay that's the end of my review thank you